the new painting collection is well underway now. I have six paintings all done. I'm really happy with it. I don't know if I told you, but I decided to call it True Colors. That's the name of the collection. Obviously, there's inspiration behind it. I guess I'll talk about that in a separate video. Go a little deeper into my thought process and my inspiration. I've painted mostly in larger formats so far, but today I want to tackle a couple small formats. I've got two canvases ready here. I really, really love the color palette that I got, like the color placements. I almost even want to keep it like that. I had a few comments of people saying, I like it without the black, or why don't you keep it colorful like this as an abstract piece. I understand how you feel because I feel that way, especially about these two ones. I just got them really nicely, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna keep it colorful. I'm gonna put some black. I have a guitar design that I'm gonna put on this. They're both gonna be the same guitar design, but I'm gonna try to put different color placements. It's pretty nice. I like the small format, but it was 
kind of more difficult than a larger one as anticipated. The fluid medium is kind of thick and it makes thick lines, but it was still doable. I'm pretty satisfied with the result. Off camera, I painted the other version as well. I worked it a little differently. I used like a dry brush stroke to paint a bunch of the features of the guitar and I barely used any fluid medium except for the headstock. For the rest, I was able to paint just with a paintbrush without any mediums. It gives a very different result. I like both. What I'm realizing though is that since it's a small format, I can afford to have a bunch of colors, like leaving all of the guitar with bursts of color, all of the fretboard as well doesn't feel too much compared to maybe a larger painting like this where I have to balance it a little bit more. Here, even if I left a whole bunch of sections with bursts of colors, it works. On this one, the first one that I did, there's a lot less color compared to the black. I think they're both nice though. This one is a little bit more quirky. I don't know, I like both. What do you think? Do you like this one or this one? I like the dry brushing of this one though. I like the texture and I rubbed off some texture on the fretboard to give it like a um, vintage feel. And I like the rougher texture. I do like that. So I might bring that into the bigger paintings. Also I have a bunch of paintings prepped already. Look, all of these. And on the wall I've got some with a sketch already done. This is what's to come. There's something about a small painting that is like special and precious. I don't know. But tell me in the comments if you like the one with more colors or if you like both equally. It's going to help me because I think I have, yeah, I have two more small formats. So I'll know a little bit more what the consensus is. Let me know if you want more inspiration. You can watch this one next and I will see you in just a few days for another one. Thanks for watching.